Come on. Come on. Storm Arwen brought severe weather, including high winds of up to 100 miles an hour, uh, rain, snow and ice, causing the most severe disruption since 2005. Many people across the country, but particularly in Northern England and Scotland, have been without power for a number of days. Three people have tragically lost their lives in incidents related to the storm. My thoughts, and I'm sure the thoughts of the whole House, are with those uh, people and their loved ones. I also want to reassure people who are still without power, who are exhausted, who are worried and who are angry that we are all working incredibly hard to make sure that their n normal conditions return. We have incredibly dedicated teams of engineers who have been working all round the clock to restore the network. The scale of the restoration effort uh, engineers uh, are facing is enormous. The weekend saw exceptionally strong winds, as I said, of almost 100 miles an hour, which have brought large trees and debris down onto power lines. For example, in central Scotland, uh, wind speeds have, have, like this have only been seen twice in the last 25 years. And of course, to add to this complex situation, <clears throat> much of the damage is in remote and hard to reach places.